And here's my chance is the only page that naturally rolls high that I can use as well. Let me put this on set three and just give it to this guy. I am legitimately worried about the Porcubus fight. We're gonna try it though. We might need to save this for later. Okay, so the way this works is uh, you don't want to have pleasure. If the target has three pages of pleasure, deal 20 damage and exhaust those pages. Yeah. So you can just kind of beat him up outside of that. Okay, these are the easier ones to block if I actually had defensive dice. Because now there's a chance he'll just evade. I do get plus one power, plus two. That's plus three power, so six to ten and six to nine. That's my best odds. I'm just going to do that on both people. It's going to hurt me a bit, but oh well. And then we want to inflict as much burn as we... Oh, that's Zach. Why'd you have to roll higher? I have to redirect one of them. Fine. That works. Okay, there's some damage. Nice. Damage is always damage. Four bleed as well. Where's the... That's the not dangerous one. Uh, it still kind of hurts because they have high, high evade rolls. This is better though. Uh, I have to try to beat those evade dice somehow. Here's my chance. I I'm just going to go with what I ha think is most likely in this case. Which actually, I have this backwards. You clash with that one, and you clash with that one. <laughs> there we go. Okay, burn is the important thing, because that's what we have this floor built around. That's a feeble. Ow. Uh, <laughs> ow. <coughs> Why did that do so much damage? Echoes is stagger damage. That doesn't really matter. We've dealt a decent amount of stagger, actually. This might be the play. Because we don't have any pierce dice, so that doesn't matter. I'm picking it. Because we could realistically stagger him. Okay, who has pleasure? You... Oh, God. Um, <laughs> this is not a good... This is not a bad page, though. It does a lot of damage. You have it. I have to kind of clash it with itself. You know what? No. I'm in a daring decision. Fuck that. You don't have any pleasure, so I'm just going to try to block this if possible. With a pleasure. No, with a daring decision. <laughs> Duh. I should have inflicted more burn. Oh, well. Oh, he had feeble. I was, I'm done. Uh, th this is not... Oh, no, I have to use pages that have the pebble. It doesn't matter what pages. Just give it to one of them. It doesn't matter. I also have to have pages in my hand for the pebble to even show up. Good to know. <laughs> ah, yes, Sunset Blade. Uh, the problem here is now he's going to recover a ton of Stagger Resist. I don't have to let him. Hang on. Okay, yeah, I don't have to let him. I can just ignore the first one, because it only inflicts one anyways. Oh, come on, buddy. Okay, that is a lot of burn. Ow. <laughs> this is fine. He hasn't used anything really scary, to be honest. Also, Pebble does nothing if you don't have any pages in your hand. That's good to know. Damn. I thought that would work. Unfortunate. Okay, we won. 
He dies this turn to burn. I'm just gonna let him hit me now. This is gonna deal a shit ton of damage to me, and I don't care. Never mind, it didn't do anything. He just incinerates. Plant boy. Okay, that wasn't hard at all. <laughs> I don't know why that was something I was worried about. Now Netsack is the best floor. And now we can actually do uh, Zhang's office. So every time you kill one of the little spiders, he becomes active for two scenes, right? Target's foes for two scenes after an ally dies, yep. Target's foes with cocoon status effect, which is inflicted by the big one. They do pierce. Oh god, they do pierce. Um, <laughs> okay. I don't have any resistance for that. Oopsie. It's actually okay. They don't roll very high, so I can clash with whatever I want to. This is not going to be easy, though, because they do attack a lot. And defense is bad for this fight. Good to know. They're also very weak to blunt. So that's a plus. If only I could bring Yasad's floor. Oh, come on. If only I could bring Yasad's floor to this fight. That would be great. Nice. I didn't even realize I had a defense. Okay. Look of the day, of course. Alright, what do we got? They have another attack, don't they? Yeah, thin webbing, which is just bind, which really doesn't matter, actually. So I'll ignore that guy. Okay. Ink over won't kill, but I don't want to be left with really low. I have one disarm, so it'll be plus one power. So that's a two to ten evade. It's unlikely to work well. I'll, I'll just hit him. Oh, both of you are attacking this guy. Uh, okay. So he's actually going to get hit a lot. And by a lot, I mean some. You just get to hit whoever really you want. So I'll hit that guy. The, the oopsie. Uh... <laughs> I keep forgetting that I have Look of the Day. That is unfortunate. That Clash loss. Yeah, this fight's hard. Like, this is one of the harder ones. All, on, all things considered. Okay, Stingy Fangs. And there's the Thin Webbing. Okay. Wow. Rude. Uh, I can kill this one. I think, yeah, honestly, ink over is a good idea here. And I want to use silent mist on one of these guys to block as much of the thing as I can. You can just kind of hit somebody. Not the guy using thin webbing, though. Okay, maybe don't forget about look of the day, please. Thank you. Thank you, me. Okay. <laughs> RNG lit. I st okay, I just killed that guy. That was a mistake. Uh, this is going to be problematic now. Because I didn't mean to kill him there. Can we do 30 stagger damage to the boss? That is the question. Oh, not with one bind we can't. Does it always target the person who gets the kill? I think it does. I cannot save you, so I'm going to let you die. <laughs> and by that I mean I'm not going to let you die. I'm just going to try to block it. I actually might... I'm not going to get staggered by this. If it's the same turn. I don't know if it's the same turn. I like Spider Butt as an abnormality, for the record. So we have two scenes to fight him. No, I can't do that, though, because if I do, I get staggered, so... I 
I can't ignore the mini spiders. It just doesn't work out. Yeah, targets foes who have killed an ally. Wait, so if there's no ally who's killed him, then he won't do anything next turn. That's actually good to know. So maybe I should let him die. Uh, <laughs> I don't know, honestly. I'm going to try to. I'm going to see what happens when I do. Come on. Come on. There we go. Okay, it is instant. That's unfortunate. I really hope... I wish that weren't instant. I hope that guy doesn't die, actually. Oh, that's not good. Okay, he didn't die. That means the minions will be attacking him. Oh, you're not doing anything. Okay, yeah, now is my chance to hit the cocoon itself. I don't think I'm going to be able to stagger it, because I didn't roll enough. If I had ink over, I could stagger him this scene. Should I just kill the minions? I should probably kill the minions. I could save him. Hold on. I could actually save him. I'd be stupid not to. Hold on. No. Use scattering slash. Because that way I get some stagger back. Hopefully, anyways. Well, <laughs> hopefully was the key word there. I underrolled it by one. So that's good. Uh, shyness. I could just give this to you because you do have a cumulus wall in hand. Why her? <laughs> like, actually, why are you targeting Hot? What did she do to you? It won't even kill her. That's the worst thing. I'm gonna kill your baby because of that. <laughs> I hope you realize. That did 17 damage. Okay, that was a bad roll. <laughs> oh well. Okay, I can redirect it. That's good. Okay, kill that, please. Uh, that's actually a roll, isn't it? You are going to attack the boss. And pray that he kills the baby. Damn. I mean, he killed him. <laughs> which is what I wanted. Okay, now we have to kill the boss within five scenes. Or we're dead. That's who I wanted to be hit by that. Which shouldn't... This honestly shouldn't be hard. Yeah, he's staggered now. 18! <laughs> Odd does so much damage. Man, why do people not use this floor? I don't understand. Odd's so freaking strong, dude. Okay, we won. This is a hard fight, though. No one likes Hod? You're banned. <laughs> Okay, so we know Sakura isn't even worth blocking. <laughs> These guys deck themselves out really quickly because they don't really have good draw. Despite their passives. So, yeah, these guys have discard synergy, which is really nice. Because discard is probably our best weapon right now. Once we have synergy for it. Alright, let's try. Yeah, Malkuth with puppets won't be too bad, but aside from that, it's going to be kind of hard. Ah, uh, lag. <laughs> She's using soccer at turn one. Bruh! I forgot to give passives to the last guy. Oops. That's okay. It doesn't really matter. I can just... Here, here's my chance on the minions. Oh, yeah, they inflict fragile. I, did, I forgot. Killing Hanafuda is probably my priority, because then she won't draw... Wait, how many pages are in your hand? Two? Why are you even using this? <laughs> it's not going to help you. It's going to be a 262625. That's not good. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, this fight's not gonna be that bad now. I thought it would be harder. These guys have good passives, but no idea how to build a proper deck. Which is funny because they work in a casino. <laughs> True. Five burn. Also, they deck themselves out like I said they would. Wow, they hate you. Uh, <laughs> Shuffle hands is hard to block. I'll give them that. It's just a legitimately hard page to block. Okay. All right, that is 13 burn. Um, <laughs> yeah, burn is going to be a good single person setup just because of that. All right, we're going to pick echoes because they're all pretty low on stagger. She can't even use anything. That's incredible. <laughs> Fucking great. You're so good, Hanafudo. I mean, come on. I can just ignore her. I can literally ignore her. No, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm going to inflict more burn, because that's my goal. Unfortunate. I mean, that's not the burn hit. Three! I love that. Damn. That's okay. They are weak to slash stagger, the grunts. Jakan is so brain-dead unga. These guys aren't Jakan, they're rusted chain link. Which is the same, to be fair. Alright, flip the table and load... Literally the two pages that you're not supposed to use. Good job. <laughs> Good job. I missed what? Oh, okay. She dies to burn. Good. Because I don't want to deal with her anymore. When do grunt pages stop having weaknesses? Uh, I believe Star of the City is the answer. Oh, oh I forgot to build a pierce, dude. <laughs> Oops. Well, that's okay. Yeah, I need to make a pierce dude for this floor. Debuffs can be hot, but I need pierce. But yeah, now that we have Laughing Powder, Netsack is going to be used in basically every fight. I do not get bonuses. I should not clash with this. Yep, 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 okay. <laughs> One! Nice! I didn't take any stagger damage there. Uh... <laughs> Look at that burn. Netsu's sustain is way too good. Let's be honest. That'll kill that guy. I do not need to do that. <laughs> uh, sure. Clean up on him. Clean up on him, because that's what you have. I'm actually gonna flaming bat. Wait. You target that guy. Go. Nice. Ow. All right, see you, Scarfy. Have a good day. There's no reason for me to pick any of these. We've won the fight at this point. They're all super weak. That guy's gonna get bodied. Yeah, he's getting hit again this turn as well. Okay, he dies to burn. 
He's staggered, and this guy's gonna take a ton of damage, and he's staggered. Okay, well that didn't go nearly as badly as I thought it would. We did not take much damage there. I probably wasted an attack. We might not kill this guy. Yeah, we're not gonna kill this guy, that's fine. He has seven health. You ready to use an index pros like key page? I actually did that in my main playthrough, if you remember. <laughs> like, I brought an index pros light with speed two to, I think, Hod's realization. Oh, index pros light doesn't have any weaknesses. That's true. Good afternoon, Arbus. Yeah, index pros light doesn't have any weaknesses, so. Neither does Smiling Face Key Page, but I'm not going to use that. But these are the big ones. They do not have a lot of HP. Actually. But that's okay. Oh, their, their resistances are flipped from in the fight. In the fight, they're weak to Slash, but resistant to Pierce. Why did they do that? <laughs> Zhang's Office Fixer Discard Dex. What we can actually do... We can have sustain in the form of, uh, where is it? Mika's page, best choice only costs one for some ungodly reason. And then also we can have Hanafuda stacking the deck because those are both blues. We can either do this or we can just take uh, in times like these from rain because that's a three cost for one strength. But this is where discard really starts to be viable. Now, I know I keep calling... I call Sakura trash, but it does let us run another page that can discard most of my hand, is the thing. And that's kind of important. So... Shuffle Hands is also Draw Engine. Obviously, we're going to run three Daring Decisions, because why wouldn't we? Uh, we're actually going to run three copies of Stay Calm as well. For discarding. Uh, we can run a Sakura just for another option to discard everything, even though it's kind of bad. The Minerals being five does make us get way more Emotion Coins. Man, I just wish this page was good, is all. Uh, I could realistically run Ink Over in this deck, and that is funny to me. Oh, you know what's cool, actually? Uh, Relay also draws a page upon being discarded. Uh, we basically always have our full deck with this build. <laughs> um, I would, it would be helpful to have some light in it, though. Running Sakura and Outburst, the world is coming to an end. You know... It's because the utility that they have right now. I'm using them as utility, not as damage dealing, which is not how they're supposed to be used. Netzak's going to be almost invincible. There are a lot of pierce attacks on this fight, actually, I just realized, which means this fight is not specifically suited for it, this floor. Uh, that's okay. Do I want to run the haste? I don't think the haste matters here. Wow. Wow. <laughs> fair play. Alright. Also fair play. I don't win that, do I? I do have plus two power, but paralysis means I cannot win against that. This is just structural analysis, which is not a big deal. So I just eject? No, because I have paralysis. Well, I mean, if it hit the block die, it'd be fine. I hate paralysis, man. What's the best? I guess technically the best thing I can do here is draw one, actually, because I'm not going to get a hit in anyways, and I can't reduce the damage, so I'm just going to take it. I resist blunt anyways, so. It's still a lot of damage, though. Nice. I actually beat Observe. Okay, the pun didn't work. Ball locks. <laughs> Dalek is very short. She's like 140 centimeters tall or something. I have no idea how I'm going to block that. 
<laughs> um, that is a five nine six seven. No, five nine six eight. I can't block that with anything, unfortunately. So I'm going to ignore him. Okay, you are a coward, Bono. Who was he targeting? Okay, good. I was gonna say I would use the other thing if he wasn't. That's a retaliate, right? No, that's a stab and detonate. And then we have to pick somebody to hit here. I think hitting Dalok would probably be better. I can't do anything about structural analysis. Yeah, I'm gonna hit Dalok. Bono is a big threat. He's not weak to slash though is the problem. So hitting Dalok would actually give me more efficiency. Unfortunate, that. Oh well. That's just gonna hurt. I, there's nothing I can do about Dalok if he has strength. Oh, come on. I don't even have paralysis and I lost. Alright, laughing powder. Okay. You're using observe again. Okay. I can't redirect you this time. So, this. Two paralysis really sucks. Oh boy, can I redirect that? Yeah, I'm gonna have to. Sorry, he's gonna take a lot of damage this turn. Paralysis really cocks up everything here. Okay, this is a bad hand. Uh, so I wanna outburst here. We gotta try to kill Bono. Cause he's gonna deal too much damage. Stab and detonate does more on average. Actually, that's not true, but you know. Retaliate rolls way too low with paralysis. I almost beat it! <laughs> Sorry, I had to cough. Uh, yeah, deal damage to... Okay, that looks weird without the key page. Oh well. Simple, you don't. True. Alright, I think we pick... Echoes, right? How much stagger is this do they have? Enough. I want to get my stagger back, is the thing. Yeah. I don't like picking that page, but oh well. Two paralysis. Oof. Big oof. Uh, can we kill him this turn? You're getting attacked. That's actually not that bad of an attack. Just gonna do that. That's a two. That is not going to win against that, never mind. Here's my chance, could kill. So I'm gonna try. Daring decision, of course. Okay, good. Because Bono is easily the most annoying enemy here. Ow! <laughs> That's fine, honestly. I don't care. But Jesus. What about it? How many abnormality cards affect your entire team or all the characters? Not many, but generally because they're pretty strong effects is the reason. I can't even... So I'm just not going to do anything with you this turn. Because I can't even use Sakura because uh, it won't work. Wait, no. What? I wish you didn't have paralysis, because now you can't kill her. Well, okay, mend weapon could. It did not. I actually did the wet strats. Yo. <laughs> I've never used that page properly. That's a good start. Oh, boy. Um, I just... Hmm. Because that's a 4-5, four, 4-5, five, 4-5. Four, five, four, five. I think I Sakura this. <laughs> um, Daring Decision does more, but I want the battle symbol, so. Yeet. Oh my god, I actually used Sakura properly. Yo! <laughs> 
Zakar being useful. The only reason it's in the deck is because uh, I need another page that discards a lot. And this is why. Because <laughs> this draws four, restores one light. Not that I'm gonna, yeah. And heals as ma however many pages I had in hand times three. Netzak, as long as he can discard, will never die.